My mom goes in for a minor surgery. I felt something in my lungs and I couldn't breathe. I had a hard time breathing. So I pretty much collapsed on the bed and they realized that I had a blood clot on my lung, which was traveling towards my heart. She went into a coma. My wife was, you know, at the point of death. It pushed me to get on my knees and to go to God for myself. At that moment, mommy couldn't pray. The doctors told me that they had lost her. I'm not a cheater, but I almost think I would cheat if I could walk all over you. Yeah. Kira does have this thing for bad boys. It's exciting, because you never know what you're going to get from them. I mean, everybody was telling Kira to break up with me. They knew I was a hood dude. When we was together, she saw me at the store with this woman, and she didn't like that. Then you do stuff like what I did, try to run him over with a car. Yeah, she saw she saw Red and just, you know, wanted to end his existence. Act like you were part of love and hip hop. That, 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 ain't, that, 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 that ain't what God called me to do. In my childhood, we were in Detroit, Michigan on West Outer Drive. A lot of people knew where we lived because my parents were so open to letting the entire church come to the house at some point. Our house was a target. We weren't flashy, but you know, when you have something together and it's solid, it attracted some kind of attention. Our house got broken to like seven times. Like I remember one time we came home and like my mom and dad, they expensive coats was like just laying in the alley. The last time they broke into our houses, they came in through Kiara's bedroom window. 